The ship is a city in eastern Macedonia with 50,000 inhabitants. It is an administrative, economic and cultural center of the eastern part of the country and, with the establishment of the Gotsa State University, it has also become an important educational center for the east of Macedonia and beyond. March 22nd is a vital date of the calendar of the city. It is the day honoring the suffering of the Holy Forty Martyrs of the city of Sebastia in Asia Minor, who became martyrs for their Christian faith in 320. According to the centuries-long tradition of the citizens of Shtip, on Chetrse, as the holiday is called in a local dialect, large number of them climb the nearby hill of Isar and, after a visit to the church, at which a service is held honoring the holy Christian martyrs, many of them climb all the way to the summit of the hill. Here, among other things, are the remains of the fort walls of the medieval city, dating, according to the conducted archaeological research, from the early Middle Ages. Within the fortress, rising above the city foundations, remains of the Christian church has been discovered. The climb up of the Easter Hill by the citizens of Stip, taking place large scale on the Feast of the Holy Forty Martyrs, which also coincides with spring, the finest season of the year, is associated with the Christian cult of these holy martyrs for their faith, a cult that was probably developed as a continuance to the pre-Christian cults of the ancient population of this region, that served to mark the end of winter and the arrival of spring. The large participation of the younger population certainly serves as a reminder of the connection between the most beautiful stage of life, youth, and the finest season of the year, spring. From an ethnological standpoint, we might say this event is related to the Feast of the Holy Forty Martyrs. On this day in Stip, people visit the Easter bright and early in order for everyone climbing up the hill to throw 40 pebbles and then people living around the Easter celebrate the day, prepare fire-buttered 40 mekitsi. The people climbing up the Easter greet 40 acquaintances and there is also other little rituals associated with the number 40. Today the Holy Orthodox Church honors the suffering of the Holy Forty Martyrs of Sebastia. They were all Roman soldiers, young men, who endured brutal torture for their faith in our Lord Jesus Christ, only to be executed at the end. While they were being tortured in the freezing lake, forty fiery hallows descended from the night sky and stood above these holy martyrs' heads. But the climb up the Easter hill itself is accompanied by certain rituals, some of which are related to the number 40. Many, especially among the young, practice 40 greetings with the acquaintances, which have recently been shown by 40 kisses, whereas every young man or woman who has climbed the Easter has to collect 40 small stones. According to custom, 39 of the pebbles are thrown off the hill into the Bregalnica river, and the fortieth is kept and placed beneath the pillow before going to bed that night. It is believed that if all the, these rituals are performed on Chetrse, the night the person that you are going to dream is the person that you are going to get married with. There are such among the young of Stip that believe in all this, but most of them only do this for amusement. We used to throw pebbles every year. I am not thrown this year. I am done. Did you throw pebbles? Are you going to? Have you thought of a wish? What would you like? No, we are. We are thinking of a wish too, whatever we like. Apart from the members of the Christian community of the city, these rituals are also observed by the members of the Roma population who are Muslims. Did you throw pebbles? Do you think of a wish? Yes, yes, I did. I wish to have children, a blissful and happy life. This age-old tradition of Stip left a lasting impression with Djurce Petrov, a renowned Macedonian revolutionary who worked as a teacher in Stip between 1885 and 1887. In his book on the geography and ethnography of Macedonia, published in Sofia in 1896, he documented this custom, pointing out that even now, on the feast honoring the Holy Forty Martyrs, the whole population of the city comes out on the Easter to celebrate. Naturally, great support and significance to this local ritual, which certainly is an important cultural event as well, 
is offered by the mayor of the municipality of Stip. What is exclusive for Stip, that is climbing up the Isar on March 22nd on the Feast of the Holy Martyrs, we have to safeguard as tradition, and in order to do it, we need to continually add new contents. We, as local government, have set up two goals, clear the area so that the citizens could climb easily to the summit and introduce new content since archaeological research has un uncovered things that could prove interesting not only on these holidays, on March 22nd on Chetrsa, as we say in Stip, and organize an event at the summit of the Isar that would grow bigger every year. Today we have organized as best as we could, but we plan to make something more elaborate next year. There will be 40 songs or 40 performers. Everything should concern the number 40 and attract people not only from Stip but from all over. The graffiti were the idea of the young population. We have provided them with room to draw graffiti. I don't think there is a more suitable place than the gates of the city stadium and I believe that the stereotypical grey walls we used to have will become an interesting location where people will make sure to look twice to see what there is. I think that the exterior design of the city is also very important in order to lift the citizens' spirits and let them know they are living in a nice urban setting. After finishing the unofficial duty of climbing up the Isar and taking a rest at the summit of the hill, the citizens of Stip are going back in order to make room for the others to come. This tradition of the population of Stip to climb up the Isar on Chetrsa, March 22nd, has been perpetuated for centuries and passed over from one generation to the next and lives on, with a tendency to develop into a cultural manifestation of much larger scale. Kako je to? Ajde, lepo, sviđa.